WTFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials trading up 262, Nasdaq's down 170, S&P's off 18 and a half. Gold, gold contract down $6.30, traded 1662 an ounce. We have silver down five cents, nineteen dollars forty-three cents an ounce. Lights free crude up a buck, eighty-eight dollars ninety-one cents a barrel. Notes and bonds: the ten-year note up eighteen ticks, trading one eleven twenty-one. The thirty-year up twenty-seven at one twenty-two ten. And king dollar, king dollar's going the opposite way of these bonds out here today. You're up eight seventy-five. You're at one ten five seventy-five on the dollar. Euro's ninety-nine. The yen is one forty. 6.27 of the British pound is at 115 to 1 US dollar. We can open and take a look at the S&Ps, folks. Bottom line, you've had a nice volatile day out here. Uh, that being said, you got a pullback, and the pullbacks are dramatically lighter volume. So there's still once higher price. Yesterday, you hit a high out here. We had 104 million shares. You're only doing 55 right now. So bottom line, that's still a market that wants higher price. NDX 100. We take a look at the NDX 100. And it's, it's amazing, folks, that the NDX 100 actually, you know, is holding up at all because of the, the way that, you know, you had Microsoft down, Google down, Facebook down. Bottom line, you can see out inside of that, Guess what? Something's up because the bottom line, NDX is doing the exact same thing. Yesterday, well, yesterday we didn't make a high. The day, the prior day, we made a high of 59 million. You're at 39 right now. That's saying you're going to do about 49 million at the most. That's still a market that wants higher price. Now let's get over to the dollar because the dollar, bottom line, is trying to make its way higher once again. Now the trend line, which our old man, our man, Mr. Bud Rolfs, would always explain to us. You know, when you break the trend, which we did, we broke that trend on Tuesday, we'll see whether it's going to come back up and test the top of that trend. Uh, bottom line, you know, it's got some juice out here today. You're up uh, 865. You rejected the 109, 535. And where the, the little problem lies here is that you're back inside the range. You know, we broke that range yesterday. And so you, there's two different numbers here. One, we still did break the channel line with conviction. The second one, though, is the swing. The swing there is 110.055. You're at 110.75579. So we'll, you know, see, we'll see what shakes out. But you can see it does add continued pressure on the markets. Stay right there, folks. Come right back. Dow. Dow Industrials right now up 295. NASDAQ is down 158. S&Ps are off 15. We'll come right back. Sharpen.